watching a previous live stream from Twitch. I interact with the chat during this video, so while it may seem like I'm crazy, I'm actually not. Don't worry, I'm not insane. Join me occasionally on Twitch and I'll post videos when I go live. How did... Oh, God... Dang it. Okay, you walked right into that. It's my fault. All right, let's give it one last shot here. I know these aren't going to go at this point, and there's no way the British are going to accept, but we'll give it a shot. There, I swear to God, there must be a 1.5, 2 million dead British right now. Um, in both Indian and primary continent, it's like there's no way that there's that much survival in this, though. That was a big one that I just saw, and I don't know what it was. Fuck up me, Portugal. Oh yeah, we need all that research. <laughs> I killed 213 of them for loss of nine guys in the mountains. That's game. That should be game here. Yep, there it is. All right, so I ended the game one, well, one three one here with four major powers I'm fighting. My God. All right, so next highest, actually, uh, number two was actually the U.S. followed closely by Britain. Uh, then nowhere close in here, but Mexico became a great power. <laughs> oh my god, alright. So, let's see here. I like the fact that the United States, Canada, and Mexico are all great powers. That's fantastic. <laughs> Russia got beaten below the Ottomans. Um, otherwise, yeah, that's pretty normal. So, what we're going to do here... Let's go ahead and reload a little bit and see what their demands would be. Like, if I white pieced out the UK... Alright, so let's see here. Uh, let's grab this one really quick. And then I want I'm gonna show you guys one other thing. Uh, when I do this, after I get done doing this, so yeah. Alright, so if we went through... Alright, let's see what happens. If, alright, first off, post piece process that oh I'm still at war with Italy in this one alright we'll give them what they want our land returned event uh oh oh god that's what they took out of this I barely even care about that okay whatever 
Um, then if we went through and white pieced out the British. Twenty six seventy nine down to eighteen seventy five. I would drop down to third in the Great Powers list. Force me to dismantle and force me to dismantle. All right, so. Demobilize. Uh, look at the size of my armies. Nothing left. Nothing over here. Nothing down here. I've lost uh, pretty much all my armies. Sanctions lifted. Yep, alright. Yeah, use German names, I guess. All right, so let's see how this breaks down. This is, ah, oh, god dang it, Denmark. Oh, god dang it. All right, well, what do you want? Yeah, go ahead and have it. All right, Danes get their lands. All right, we're about to become a republic. This is gonna be great. I want to. I want to. Oh god, who are you, Croatia? What do you want? Fine, I'll, I will give you what you want. I'm down to 40 prestige. Oh god, communists. Oh god. It, lift the sanctions. We admitted our defeat. Leave us alone. And do transport. I want to see. I want to see how the German Empire breaks apart here. God, I d look at this. Look at this mess. Um, suppress you. German uprising. Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. Do it. So what did that? Uh, what did that kick off? Weighted universal. Okay, so we've now switched over to a semi-constitutional monarchy. Yep. No longer have that. Yep. Okay. Uh, and that's what Germany has become. That that looks like World War One Germany, is what that looks like. We got Poland with uh, Ponzo and Pomerania and Sardinia. Oh my god. Look what happened to my beautiful German Empire. Let's see here. Uh, what am I other whole well, let's see here. This went to the Netherlands. This became a whole level of cluster. Oh my god, the French are taking it? French and Canada are taking that. Do they already divide this up or is this they have to be doing more. Panama has became a thing. Costa Rica has been released. Cuba has been released. Yep. All right, so let's see what happened here. Um, yeah, germ looks like the British are taking most of it. Yeah, British took all of Indonesia. Just about all of Indonesia. Netherlands, oh, nope, that's nationalist China. Yeah, look at this.
good but god, there goes my entire empire. Alright, so the United Kingdom took everything, by the way it looks, uh, minus a few handful of colonies. Uh, is that Italy? Yeah, Italy took Vietnam. That's World That's World War One level Germany right there, everyone. That's pretty much what that is. That's post-World War One Germany. And frickin' Holstein's a thing. I don't even have the Kiel Canal, so I went from controlling all three canals to losing them all. I'm down to 40 prestige. I'm sixth in the world. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. All my Central American holdings are gone. The Kaiser the freaking Kaiser's uh vacation home there in Panama is gone. Forget that. I do love the yeah, crack down. I love the fact that the Rio Grant's a thing. Oh, am I still allied with freaking Really? Still allied with Greece. You guys are no longer my puppets. All my puppets have been released. I have some influence in there, but not much. Did I lose all my cores in here? Yep, I did. Uh, Greeks are on their own. I'm not getting into another war. Estonia, Latvia. Yeah, this is post-World War I Germany right here is pretty much what you're looking at. <laughs> All right, here's a question. Um, Cultural-wise, yeah, that's uh, that's what that looks like. Wow. Oh boy, I encourage fascism all over around here. <laughs> so I just encourage basically Hungary, Austria, Czechoslovakia, um, all to become fascists. I lost all my cores in here. Oh boy, that's awesome. That is awesome. Let's let this in. I want to see how this one ends. Oh, sweet! The Fascist Coalition won! I didn't even try to do that. That's fantastic! I want to see if they turn- I, I want to see if we turn in Nazi Germany here before the end. Yeah, become more fascist. Let's encourage all this fascist loyalty, because why not? I do still have Switzerland, which is bizarre. Luxembourg became a thing, and they got released. Right, yeah, I have no more war. I'm, I'm below the Empire of Japan. My god, I'm a terrible, terrible place. That just that would just destroy my empire entirely. The British better have moved up to number one on this. No, US still is. They have such a high level of uh, industrialization, though. That's probably why. Oh, dude. And, yeah, we're not even dealing with this. Yeah. So that's what would have happened if I would have surrendered. Knocked down to sixth place instead of first. Now there's one thing I want to show you guys. I have my test um, game here. This is one that I started after, um, after the Austria, um, after forming Germany in my primary leaf uh, leaf game, um, and I didn't get all the cores. And I'm like, why didn't that happen? Now you'll notice I'm at 19 January 1st, 1916. I'm number one. Um, across the board. You'll notice that Luxembourg still exists, that's fine. And I've taken a good chunk of France, taken a good chunk of all this mess over here. Romania is not as big. And the reason I was able to do that was because I got cores on all of Austria, Austria-Hungary compared to in my uh, in the current game I was running where I only got cores into basically uh, like right around there-ish kind of thing. So in this game, I was able to absorb all of Austria-Hungary here, um, all of it in a single war, and then I went to war. Um, 
I, and I should note, I absorbed that for the low, low cost of only 20 infamy, which I was able to uh, use and keep under the actual limit. Now, in this one also, you'll notice that Yugoslavia is getting a little big for their boots um, kind of thing because we did just fight a uh, dismantle on the French Empire. And I know for a fact that Russia is going to come gunning for us um, here sooner rather than later uh, because they're allied to both the, uh, France and uh, France and Britain. But it's one of those, I mean, this, other than the Dutch kind of thing, this is, uh, this is what I was hoping for happened. This is a good super Germany, and I still have time. I have Yugoslavia as my puppet. I have Romania as my puppet, with Greece as my puppet also again. Um, I took over Albania because they uh, they wouldn't uh, integrate into uh, they wouldn't integrate into uh, Yugoslavia, so I just took them over. And then if you look, the Kaiser's uh, vacation home is quite a bit larger in this one. And also I took over Haiti instead of Cuba um, because Cuba was released as a puppet in this one, so whatever. Uh, but you see the Kaiser's vacation home is quite a bit larger here. But yeah, I thought I would share this one with you. It's like, this is the Germany I really want to create. Part of the problem could also be, too, that um, in my primary game that we just played, I stayed as an absolute monarch, so I will say that was a success. We stayed as an absolute monarch through the entire thing, which is a step forward, at least. As opposed to this one, where I have elections and everything, and we're on what? I think we're on Universal right now? Yeah, Universal voting. I'm a full-blown, I'm basically a full-blown uh, republic at this point. I'm just constitutional monarchy. So, I thought I would share that with you guys. Alrighty, a um, few things we learned in this one. One, planes cannot be left on their own um, in defensive areas, even if they are really good defensive. Um, we're going to have to modify those defensive ones to definitely have some infantry. So we'll probably have to do a 5-5 five, five, um, balance there, which would be 5 infantry. Yeah, 5 infantry and uh, 5 planes at that point because the planes just have such good defensive uh, maneuver in them. Could also just do 5... Hmm, thinking about that. It could be 5 infantry and five artillery at that point of negating the need for the planes anyway but I don't know how that would pan out with the uh, with the massive defensive bonus that the planes get so alrighty what time are we looking at here we're looking at oh just about nine o'clock okay now I was going to move on to Stellaris after my Germany playthrough here but I'm waiting for the 2.2 update so we can do some more Vicky. We could do some State of Decay 2. Um, we could do some Tropico. Because I actually have to redo that. Tell you what, guys. Uh, talk about it in the chat here. Um, if you can. If any of you are listening. It looks like some of you are listening. Uh, we basically do. We could do Vicky um, as the French Republic. We could do um, Tropico 5. Starting over here, and the reason for that being that um, I suck on the last mission, and also I accidentally deleted the recording sessions. Or we could do some State of Decay 2. So if you guys are in the chat, just go ahead and uh, put it up here. I'm going to, I gotta go get, refill my drink, and I'm gonna take a leak, and I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> 